all of us would probably know that the pH of acids is less than 7, that of salts is 7 and that of bases is more than 7. Do we really understand what pH is? Let's dive a bit deeper into this concept. Ok, let's start with the basics. How do we identify if a substance is an acid or a base? That's right, we use an indicator. But given two acidic solutions, how do we know which one is stronger amongst them? How can we judge how strong an acid or a base is? And that's what pH helps us with. It gives us the measure of the strength of acids or bases. How does it do that? The pH takes into account the concentration of H plus ions in the solution. Yes, the pH measures the strength of acids and bases. But you'd probably be thinking that if pH only considers the concentration of H plus ions, how can it tell us how strong a base is? Remember, bases also contain H plus ions. Just that the concentration of H plus ions is far lower than that of the concentration of OH minus ions, so low that they are generally ignored. So to know how strong an acid or a base is, we have the concept of a pH scale. And it ranges from 0 to 14. 0 being very acidic and 14 being very basic or alkaline. And the pH of a neutral solution right here in the middle is 7. Understand that the pH is just a number which tells us how acidic or basic a solution is. More the concentration of the hydrogen ion, lesser will be the pH value. Yes, understand this well. More the concentration of the hydrogen ion, lesser will be the pH value. Now, if you look at the scale, as we go towards the left, the pH value is decreasing. Which means that if we go leftwards on the scale, the H plus ion concentration increases. And as we go rightwards, the H plus ion concentration reduces. And we know that higher H plus ion concentration implies that the solution is more acidic. So the acidic nature increases as we go towards the left. And as basic solutions have lower concentration of H plus ions, the basic nature increases as we go towards the right. So this pH scale is a very general way to understand how strong an acid or a base is. Let's take a very basic test to check if you've understood the concept of pH scale. I have two solutions A and B. Solution A has pH of 2 and solution B has a pH of 4. Which one is more acidic? Yes, solution A is more acidic as its pH is lower. Here's another one. Solution C has pH of 5 and solution D has a pH of 10. Which one is more basic? Note that solution C is acidic and solution D is basic. So relatively, solution D is more basic and we can see that its pH is higher too. A good way to remember this is to think of the first two letters of the English alphabet. A and B. Acidic on the left and basic on the right. And don't forget, we still don't know how the number on the pH scale is calculated. That involves logarithms which we haven't looked at yet. But how is the pH of a solution actually measured in real life? We'll see that in the next video.